Do you know where you can find one of the oldest church in the Philippines? Allow me to give you a brief history about this church. Magandang araw mga kagala It's weekend So heto may time tayo para maglakwat siya Lakwat siyang may katuturan naman So ano pang hinihintay natin? May na tara ng bumiyahe Ang bibisitahin natin ngayon is yung St. Andrew Cathedral From Ebacom Plaza, Paranaque, sumakay na ako ng jeep na may signage na kabihasnan. If ang landmark mo is SM Sukat, pwede ka sumakay doon. Tawid ka lang ng overpass, then sakay ka ng jeep na may signage na kabihasnan. 10 pesos lang din ang pamasahe. In 10 to 15 minutes, mararating na natin yung ating destination. So far, okay naman ang biyahe natin, hindi ma-traffic. So, mabilis-bilis tayo makakarating. Kirino Avenue na tayo. Madali lang siyang puntahan since marami yung landmark na nakapalibot sa kanya. Malapit pa siya sa market. Ayun mga kagala, natatanaw na natin. Here we go. This is the diocesan shrine of Nuestra Señora del Buen Suceso, St. Andrew Cathedral Parish, also known as Paranaque Cathedral or St. Andrew Cathedral. Paranaque Cathedral is considered as one of the oldest churches in the Philippines. It was established on May 11, 1580 by the Augustinian Order. The construction of the church began in the year 1638 and was completed in year 1650. These are the following markers found on the facade of the church. This marker officially declaring the church as the diocesan shrine of Nuestra Señora del Buen Suceso marked August 10, 2012. On this marker, it is stated that on January 25, 2003, His Excellency Most Reverend Jess E. Mercado, Doctor of Divinity, solemnly dedicated the Cathedral of St. Andrew according to the rites of the Second Vatican Council. This is the Cathedral's façade. In May 2010, it marked the 430th year of the church foundation and the newly renovated church was blessed by Bishop Jess Mercado. Every year, the parish community of St. Andrew celebrate two main feasts. The first is the feast of Nuestra Señora del Buen Suceso de Palanyag or the Our Lady of the Good event. The feast celebrated every 10th day of August. The second is the Feast of St. Andrew the Apostle. 
He is also the patron of the fishermen. The feast is celebrated every 30th day of November. Dito yung side ng entrance na malapit sa hospital ng Paranaque. This is the right wing of the church. This is the image of the early of gate which I wasn't able to take a photo.
Before, ito yung Adoration Chapel nila. But now, ginawa na siguro nila itong baptistry. On the left side view of this church, we can also find one historical marker. Siya si Padre Pedro Dandan I. Masangkay. He was a military chaplain, champion of Filipinism, and a patriot. He was charged with involvement in the Cavite Mutiny. He was one of the native clerics arrested and was exiled. These are some establishments and landmarks near the cathedral. The St. Andrew's School, the Pamilihang Bayan ng Paranaque, the La Huerta Barangay Hall and the La Huerta Fire Substation, at ang Hospital ng Paranaque. They also have their parking area. I hope na bigyan ko kayo na konting information. Thank you for watching. See you on my next destination. Bye.